Mercy Sparks, issue number one. So, um, Mercy Sparks is a character that I actually really like. She's one of my favorite comic book characters. Uh, I'm not sure if anyone is familiar with Mercy Sparks. But, um, basically, I don't know. I like her. She's a cool character. Uh, she is a demon that basically goes to Earth to do missions. <laughs> I'll explain this in this. So basically, we were introduced to Mercy Sparks. We see her living in um, Shiloh, Shiloh, uh, a form of hell. Uh, I can't pronounce it. it. Basically, it's the it's one of the Greek words for hell. Sheolo, S H E O L. Again, I can't pronounce that for the life of me. But um, she is uh, a demon in hell, and she decides to go to uh, a bar to basically just get drunk. Um, she basically had a falling out with her boyfriend. Um, so she goes to the bar to get drunk. And uh, this uh, fashionable demon arrives and basically tells her that he has a uh, deal for her. Uh, basically, he was ordered by heaven to recruit her to go to Earth and hunt down um, angels. That have basically escaped heaven and are living amongst the humans. Um, basically, her job is to uh, rip their halos off so that they get teleported back to heaven where they can receive their punishment. And of course, she, you know, says no because she doesn't want to go to earth. She doesn't want to work for heaven. She doesn't want to do any of this. Um, but she gets forced into it. And she wakes up, and this is basically her human form, so she can like blend in, because obviously she's not going to be able to blend in with human society looking like that. So uh, we see her get information on one of the demons, not demons, one of the angels, and the angel uh, is actually a works as a uh, she she's in the band, and she's basically uh, her band's performing at this club. So we get uh, Mercy Sparks, I like her outfit, pretty cool. Um, arriving at this uh club where she confronts the angel this is the angel right here angel is like on a little bathroom break and uh mercy sparks just rushes in punches her in the face and then we get a fight scene <laughs> so the uh she starts uh fighting this angel and then the bouncer arrives and the bouncer tosses both of them out into the alley and then uh the angel basically releases her angelic powers while Mercy Sparks, you know, drops her transformation um, and comes her devil form. And then we get this fight scene. I'm not going to be showing too much of the fight scene. Um, I forgot to erase the drop kick. But, uh, yeah. We, we, we get uh, but back and forth between these two. Mercy eventually gets the upper hand. Um, she does this cool kick in the face launching her up and then she uses her tail to wrap around this uh the neck of this uh angel and then slams her like power drivel style into the ground and then mercy uh grabs her halo and rips it off and basically um her body just kind of flops and goes comatose uh and uh mercy drops the body off into a trunk and um takes the halo and hops into a motorcycle and as she's riding, um, she gets tracked down by another angel. And uh, I like the artwork for this. It's, it's nice. It's clean. It's um, not using, you know, 3D artwork as far as I can see. It's uh, dynamic. Uh, you don't have, like... The problem with a lot of modern day comics is you get a lot of, like, static scenes. You just have people, like, talking. There's no, like camera angles like you just get profile shots so you just get them like you know it, it's it looks very um what's the word i'm looking for like it's just not dynamic at all but um i like how like basically here like every panel is like from a different angle um so she uh gets chased by this angel and then she um this angel is basically like pissed off at mercy like one you know you kind of hurt my friend to you know she's like why did you do that she just wanted to be free so we're kind of starting to get some idea that maybe uh 
there's something kind of going on. Maybe this isn't as simple as tracking down angels that have escaped from hell. Maybe there's something more sinister going on. Um, but yeah, she kind of burns the uh, the angel. But before she can actually uh, fight it, um, like the cops start arriving. So Mercy splits and the angel is able to get away. And then she goes to her apartment. And basically she's... Uh, I don't want to say shacking up with this dude because there's no relationship between them, like romantic wise. It's more of uh, he's aware of like the occult and stuff like that, and they're friends. And he kind of he's he's basically the um, oh my god, what's the character's name? I forgot the name of that character from uh, Kim Possible, the uh, the dude in the wheelchair who basically is always on the computer and helps uh, Kim uh, with that information. I guess for comic book fans, uh, he's basically the oracle to Mercy's Batman. Um, he kind of just tracks down information on uh, her targets and kind of gives them to her. Uh, anyway, she goes to her room where she tosses in the halo that she has, and we see she has a bunch of others when um, this guy arrives. And he uh, basically gives uh, Mercy her next orders, the next target that she has to go after. And it's um, basically uh, a higher level angel. And then uh, we cut to this priest. And uh, we see um, like the priest has just finished a sermon. He's you know thanking all his patrons and they're leaving and stuff like that. And then he goes into his office where we meet the demon and they shake hands. And now we're starting to think, okay, maybe now there's even more something sinister going on. Why is a priest working for a demon and giving him um orders to get mercy to track down other angels and take their halos um so that's how the issue ends kind of like on a cliffhanger um but yeah that's issue number one of mercy sparks uh, like i said i really like this character she's one of my my favorites i love her uh <laughs> you can kind of see a pattern with the characters that i like uh cassie hack Mercy Sparks, uh, Dante Inferno, uh, <laughs> Chastity. See, these are like some of my favorite combo characters ever. So you kind of see this pattern. Um, but yeah, if you if you like, if you're like me, and um, when it comes to like comics, you kind of prefer like, the supernatural stuff. Like I like superhero stories, but I always prefer more of the like the occult stuff. Like, I prefer more of, like, stuff like this or uh, stuff like the uh, Spooks Omega team. Stuff where basically it's, like, demon hunting, uh, supernatural, hellblazer, that kind of stuff. That's always been, like, my my favorite genre when it comes to uh, my comics and things like that. If you're like that, um, you all, you'll uh, like Mercy Sparks. Uh, nice... Nice balance between, um, you know, supernatural action. We get some lighthearted comedy. Uh, there's some, you know, serious drama and stuff, but it never gets too dramatic. It's more, more of like a just like a lighthearted uh, adventure of uh, this badass demon chick hunting down angels. <laughs> but uh, yeah, that's Mercy Sparks issue number one. Tell me what you guys think. Anyone read Mercy Sparks? If so, did you guys enjoy it? Um, if not. Does this video make you want to read it? Hopefully it does. Like I said, I, I like Mercy Sparks. She's like one of my favorites. I love this franchise. Um, hopefully we'll get to see more of it. That's that's the one thing that's kind of sad about doing some of these videos is I'm doing some videos on like some of my favorite combo characters from back in the day. And a lot of them just like, I don't know. They, they're, they're just kind of done. Um, I mean, we have Mercy Sparks. Mercy Sparks hasn't had like a new issue in forever. Uh, chastity hasn't had a new issue in forever uh bad kitty hasn't had a new issue in forever it's kind of sad because i don't know these are characters like i really i really loved and enjoyed and i would like to see more of but they're just kind of in limbo right now hopefully that changes but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys haven't already please subscribe i'm trying to hit 400 subscribers by the end of the year hopefully you guys can help me reach that Hit the bell for notification. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Feel free to comment down below. Share this with uh, other people who, you know, like uh, comics. You know, just help spread the word on this channel. I also do video game stuff. So if you know anyone that likes video game, like Let's Plays and things like that, I do that. So uh, 
you know, share that if you guys can. I much appreciate it. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys next time. Later.